Most stonemasons couldn't read, but they could all write one very important thing using their chisel and mail, their mason's mark. It was a bit like signing your name, and every mason had their own mark. Putting your mark on a building meant everyone would know who'd done the work, but more importantly, it meant you would get paid. Now this is the Chapel Royal. We can see an example of a mason's mark right here. Perhaps you could have a go at designing your own mason's mark using the initials of your first and second names. Join me at the next stop to find out even more about how to build a castle.